Here at the friendly confines, Wrigley Field. MLB The Show has action out of the NL Central. It's the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs. Joined by my partner, Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomp. And, and we got a rubber match on our hands today, partner. Yeah, the final game of a three-game set. They've split the first two, and regardless of how important a series is within the larger picture of the season, it's a game you want to get up for. Every series win feels good, so we should see a fun matchup in this one. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Just about set to go now. And on the hill in this one, Joe Xavi. Last year's Cy Young Award winner in the National yeah, League singing. Well, look, he was healthy last year and gained a tremendous amount of confidence. He took a big step forward last season. I think he'll take another one this season. Next one off the plate inside. And the count even one and one. Line drive. Nice grab. Tommy Edmond at the plate. The baseman, Tommy Edmund. First pitch, and he just misses. No score, just getting started, top of the first. Next pitch inside. Two balls, no strikes. The 2 0 is in for a strike. Here we go, guys. The wind of the pitch. Swings and misses. Two and two. And a pitch. Swing and a pop-up. Wisdom makes the grab out number two. Two outs, base is empty. Now up for St. Louis, Dylan Carlson. A switch hitter batting right. Swing at a ball popped up. I got it. I got Corner it. makes the catch, and that'll do it. Back here at the friendly confines. Here's Nolan Arenado. Pitch is in for a strike. Strike one. Zabe. He gets a lot of swing and miss, and he keeps the ball in the yard. Not to mention the fact, not too many hits either. Kenny Jansen doing home plate duties in this one. Got a huge strike zone from Jansen, so he can't really be called a pitcher's umpire, but he does like the bottom part of the strike zone. We may see some pitchers steal a few strikes down there, especially the ones right below the knees. That's if their catcher can present it properly. So, Chris, does the offense dial up the aggressiveness against him? What is the approach exactly? Well, there is confidence that, hey, I'm going to get a pitch to hit during the bat. There's some guys where you're thinking, maybe I get one pitch to hit. It's something that I have a chance to turn around. With this guy, you're going to get two, maybe three. It's just a matter of, can you capitalize? Swing and a miss. And a count, one and two. Second inning here, no score. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. Two gone. Well, obviously the knuckleball, it's not a pitch designed to blow by hitters, but you'll see this every once in a while. You give up on that pitch at the plate, and then the last moment it darts back into the strike zone, and you're just not ready to get a swing off in time. Looks like it's 100 miles per hour, and I tell you what, I know from personal experience it's not a good feeling. Next offering is in for a strike. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. St. Louis. All set for the start of the inning. And now the Nobody DH, Anderson Tejeda. That one finds the zone. Strike one. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically he likes to shoot the ball the other way. But that time, a little anxious. Sosa. And the batter will be the shortstop, Edmundo Sosa. Four for seven in the series, so he's been good. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. And he deals. 
There's a strike. I understand you want to try to gauge that guy's fastball, but you also have to be aggressive and ready to hit in your zone. Now you're in a tough spot. Kim collects it. Fires to first on the run. And save. He busted it down the line for that infield single. Digging in, Joshua Baez. Pitch misses inside. And that is ball one. Runner on the goal. And that's a stolen base, not even close. The 1 1. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. Sabi, one of the best strikeout pitchers in the game, and that certainly is a benefit to him when he's in a spot like this. And a pop up, right side, foul territory. Cooper settles under it and makes the catch. That's out number two. Well, that was a pitch you got to crush. Unbelievable that he missed it right there. And I'm telling you, he is going to be frustrated with himself until his next at bat. Tapia swings through that one as he comes to the plate for the second time today. Yeah, if you're going to be in the game in high leverage situations, you've got to be able to get the swing and miss and put hitters away. Out there to center for Armstrong. Moving under this one. Squeezes it. And that will end the inning. Welcome back. Start of the fourth. And stepping in for the Cardinals, Tommy Edmond. There's a strike. Tommy Edmond. This one in the air right field. Stewart racing over to make the catch. Now this is Dylan Carlson. Dylan Carlson. And that's in there for strike one. Ball one there. And one and two. Well, that knuckleball might have changed directions three, four, maybe even five times on its way to the plate. And that's how it's able to get a hitter to chase like that. Sometimes it looks so easy to hit when you're watching it on TV or maybe in the on-deck circle. But when you're up there at the plate, it can be one of the most confusing things you've ever seen. Arenado, the next to hit, takes ball one. Here's a 1-1. And that's downstairs and outside. That one fouled off. Two and two. And down on strikes. Third out. And that ends the frame. Back here at Wrigley Field. We go to the top of the fifth. Anthony Rizzo steps to the play. That's in for a strike. Anthony Rizzo. Left hand hitter waits. Swing and a miss. And a pitch. Misses. It's a ball and two strikes. The pitch. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Swing and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Thought it was a pretty good pitch. Top of the strike zone. We're seeing now, more fastballs in that location. Believe. Hitters, especially Sanchez. with two strikes, have to be ready to pull the trigger. Now the catcher up to hit. Ali Sanchez. He was a strikeout victim his first time. First pitch, and he has to get out of the way. Right side, hard hit. Takes it himself, and the first two set down on the top of the fifth. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Lets the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Tejeda in the box for the second time. One ball, no strikes. Next pitch is outside. That hits the dirt, and it's 3-0. He hasn't fallen behind in the count like this all day. He's in danger of walking his first batter right here. Swings and misses, and we're filled up. And a pitch. Right through there. Got it. Picks up strikeout number seven. And welcome back. Top six. Stepping in, Edmundo Sosa. Strike on the inside corner. Sosa. Check swing, but he went too far. 
and it's 0-2. And down on strikes he goes. One gone here. Oh, there's a three-pitch strikeout. He can do whatever he wants with the baseball right now. Up next for the Cardinals. Baez batting for the second time, and that's strike one. The wind of the pitch. Strike two. Boom, that hook's looking pretty sharp today. Just a solid pitching performance so far, and I really think it's because of that curveball. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Two down. Now batting. Rymel Tapia stands in with two away as he takes a ball. Next pitch is outside. Well, they've kept him pretty quiet in this series. Still doesn't have a knock. I know you want to get that first knock out of the way. Maybe more will come, but you got to give some credit to the pitching staff. They've had a great plan against him. Two and one now. Good eye in that spot. Here's an opportunity to do some damage and perhaps unlock this offense. Three one count. Be ready to turn on a fastball. Pro Armstrong settles under it, and that is that. So a knock. Back here at the ballpark, now the number two hitter, Tommy Edmond. Right down to shoot, and it's 0-1. And, no and he drops it down the third baseline. Over to Cooper, and they get Edmond for the out. And up next for St. Louis, Dylan Carlson. In there for strike one. Popped up, foul territory behind the plate. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Malone right there to make the grab. And there are two outs. That was a good pitch to hit right down the heart of the plate. Had pretty good timing now on it. Just got underneath it a little bit and popped it up. Nolan. On the ground. The throw to first. And they get Arenado for the out. We go to the eighth. Now up for St. Louis, Anthony Rizzo. Off for the car. First pitch, the first just misses. Rizzo. Next offering is in for a strike. Pick it bad right here. He did the team thing, took until he got a strike. Yeah, now he's got to go to work, shorten up that swing a little bit, do whatever it takes to get on base. But why to kick the pitch? So now one and two. One ball, two strikes. Here comes a pitch. That's out to center field. Pro Armstrong drifts towards it. Oh, no. And puts the squeeze on that one. And there's one down. So up next, Ali Sanchez. Ali Sanchez. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Kicks and deals. And now two and nothing. Well, it's been a very impressive outing so far. His command has been a big part of it. Even when he misses, he misses outside the strike zone, which is exactly what a pitcher wants. That one in for a strike, two and two. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And there's two down. So for me, that knuckleball was just devastating. I mean, you see it so well, you think you're going to go out there and get four knocks, and you just swing and miss. And I tell you what, I tried my best to put Tim Wakefield in the Hall of Fame. So we'll see. If he gets there, you know it's because of me. That one fouled off. Next offering down in the dirt. And now the lefty. Got him. And that will end the inning. Nothing doing there for St. Louis. Still looking at that 5 nothing deficit. All set to start the ninth in this one. And now the shortstop, Edmundo Sosa. Savy back to work.
That one's in there. It's 0 and 1. The pitch. Hammer, base hit. Dominant performance for him today, Boone. Two hits allowed so far. And then, well, these guys just want to keep it rolling right now. You win this series, you got another team coming in, and you want to do exactly the same. Maybe even push a little. Yeah. Mm -hmm.